in, but you can't be judgy. I'm not judgy. When am I ever judgy? I'd in your undies. Yeah, my anxiety came back. And I nearly shat myself in front of my boss. Well, still, it's better than the time that you did it behind a bus stop. I have a syndrome. Good, I needed a fresh pair. Oh, how did your mum get on? She all settled in? Oh, my God, I forgot to call her. Yeah, maybe call her back tomorrow. Yeah. I probably just need a good night's sleep. Yeah. 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 Night. 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 Yeah. You probably just need a good night's sleep. You know when you've had ten bad years, but you think you're eight hours away from a better life? <laughs> yeah, good sleep. Maggie. Maggie. Maggie! Oh, what? Do you think you'll ever have kids? What? I'll rephrase. Do you think you'll ever find someone who would want to have kids with you? Yes. Fine, no. Did you unplug the iron? I definitely unplugged the iron. Shouldn't you check, though? Oh, leave me alone! No! You're like a woodpecker on my patience, just nyeh, nyeh, nyeh. Now that we're up, let's workshop! <sighs> Should we talk about how even though your mum rots in a care home while you luxuriate in this apartment, you're both still ultimately alone? Or we could finally unpack your daddy issues when the issue is he's dead. Oh, I'm taking another one for that comment. Isn't that a bit slutty for work? She's having a shocker, everyone! Good morning, Harriet. Is it still morning? I don't know. Can you read the time while Snapchat is open? Dr. Harwood took your first patient and said to move the meeting to ten. See? You're early. I'll go be a dentist then. <laughs> oh, Dr. Wentworth, you're here. Technically, I'm here. Can I ask you something? Sure. I may have taken 30 milligrams of diazepam for a sleeping disorder. And what's the question? Good morning. Oh, what would you do if you were still a little bit... Honestly? No. I'll see how Dr Wentworth is getting on. I think you should hide for a bit. Okay. See Dr. Howard like this. I might tell him that I love him. Oh, oh! What did she do that for? I'm improvising. Don't. Acknowledged. What am I gonna do? You mean if that lump really is cancer? No. I'm. I meant about getting out of here. It's another missed call from your mum. Maybe she'll know what to do. Yeah, that seems likely. What should we do, lady with dementia? Oh, oh, uh, have you thought about forgetting what century it is or lashing out at a stranger? You <laughs> shut your mouth. That's my mum. Oh, you thought it. What have I done wrong? You're always here. I'm awake. You're here. I'm asleep. You're here. I listen to you. You're here. I ignore you. You're here. I'm just trying to look after my mum and 
keep my job and get by. But you, you're always fucking here and you never fucking stop, Feral. Calm your phone, Mitch. I'm doing my fucking best. Lane, are you okay? Yes, Dr. Harwood. Then why are you just standing in the corridor? Um, I was pausing with gratitude for my job here. Attitude of gratitude. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Maggie. Should we have that meeting about workplace behavior now? <laughs>